Hey guys, it's Di, and this is going to be more of a vlog, I think, than anything else, but I wanted to show you my Tivoli GM, my winter bag that I absolutely love using when it starts getting colder outside, that I'm getting ready to change into. And I actually wanted to show you my favorite bandeau, because I don't really feel like I ever show these or talk about these at all, but I do love them. They're very pretty. I don't use them as much as I should, but um, I, I really like them when they're just tight on your bag, and I think that they're a great kind of basic accessory to either tie if you'll wear them around your neck or that sort of thing or just a great kind of basic bag accessory if you prefer them over a charm. So I think that they just add a nice little bit of color and this is my absolute favorite one that I have. I love the pinks and the purples in it and I think it's just gorgeous. This is the Comite Bandu and I happened to just find one left at my store when I lived in Michigan and so I believe it was from around 2008-ish. Um, but I ended up finding one around 2010 left in my store, and so I was really happy that I found it. So that is my absolute favorite bandeau, and this is usually how I use them tied on my bags. I don't generally wear them around my neck or anything like that, but I do like them as a bag accessory. But then the vlogging part, I don't know, it's, it's kind of odd, I guess, to put a video on YouTube asking this, but, you know, here we go. Um, I've been thinking about my collection lately and trying to figure out what bags I'm going to get. And I've been thinking about this winter and what bags I would get the most use out of. And obviously, I really, really love this Tivoli, especially in the colder months. And I'm also planning on hopefully using my Luminous PM a lot. So you guys, if you've watched my videos occasionally here and there, you probably know what bags that I have. Those are my two that I kind of gravitate towards for the colder months. But I was trying to figure out if I added like one more bag to my collection, what do you think it should be? I I don't know if I'm over the Damier Abine for right now, but I, I was kind of thinking like maybe a speedy bandolier would be a great kind of option to work into my rotation because I do like the size and shape of the speedy, but I just, you know, obviously the handheld doesn't work for me. But now that they've come out with that in the Damier Abine, I was thinking maybe that would be a good option or perhaps the Westminster. I do have a few multicolor accessories on the way to me, but I don't think that there are any bags really that would be, you know, suitable for winter use. They all have the Vachetta leather on them. And also, um, I don't know, it doesn't seem like a lot of them are super functional as far as like being shoulder bags and that sort of thing. I feel like I have enough monogram, so obviously that, I guess that leaves like the, um, the, Imprende line, you know, the all leather lines, and so I just, I don't know, what do you guys think if you picked one bag to be in my collection, um, what would it be? And I know that's totally vague, but <laughs> I just figured I'd throw it out there. So this is what I'm switching into for right now, and I really love that it has the adjustable handles, and this is always one of my go-to bags. In the winter, I just, I really can't say enough about the style. Love it. You guys have seen my reviews and my thoughts on it before. So I just want to show it with my little bandeau on there and see if I could get some opinions on my little vlog question of if you could add one bag to my collection. And just to go through it real quickly, um, I have the Luminous, the Totally, the Tivoli, the Palermo, um, the Brea, the Eva, which doesn't necessarily work for me, and the Monty GM, Monty Girl GM, and also an Alma on the way to me, so you can check that off the list. So if you could pick one bag that was not one of those, what would it be? So thanks so much for watching, and I appreciate it if you have an opinion. Um, you know, just send me a comment down below, send me a message, whatever is easiest for you. And I was also going to, since this is turning into a vlog anyways, I was also going to say um, I've been trying my best to keep up with messages and comments from you guys. I love talking to you and giving you my opinions and that sort of thing. If you have questions about, like, which styles that I like the best that I have in my collection and that sort of thing. Um, and I'm trying my best to stay up with them. I get them a lot of different places. Um, here on YouTube, on Facebook, through email, out in the world just on different forums and things. So I do try to reply as quickly as possible. The one thing I was going to say is if you sent me a message and it's been over two weeks and you haven't got a response from you, 
from me, please just go ahead and um, send me the message back because I probably read it at some point. I just didn't realize that I didn't get a response back to you. So um, I'm doing my best to keep up with everything, um, but you know, kids and, and craziness and all that, sometimes I um, either overlook that I haven't responded or it just slips my mind. So um, that is that. So thanks so much for watching and hopefully you guys are having a great day. Bye.